Alright, welcome back to the Give Love YouTube channel. My name is Alaric, and today it's all about being inspired uh, with new gear. Um, that's the whole reason I buy gear, I've mentioned it before, but I am all about buying new gear to force me to practice. I'm not the best at practicing. You, you'll come to know that about me. I'm trying to get better, but also trying to give myself reasons to get better. Um, and new inspiration, so that's the name of the game for me. Okay, so today we have the Fig Fum, which is new to me. I uh, had no idea about Stone Deaf pedals. Um, it got returned at my work, and I saw it sitting there. And one of my customers I've been helping for a long time, he's like, "Hey, man, you should you should check that out. That's like that's right up your style. That's right up your alley." And I was like, "I don't know if I should actually play it. Like, I don't know if I should actually play it because if I play it and I like it, I'm gonna buy it. And it's 150 bucks." It's not a lot, but I do this all the time. My wife is super supportive of this, so obviously, super supportive. <laughs> um, yeah, so finding new ways to be inspired, go out there and have fun. It's awesome. So get out there and get inspired, guys. Like, just go out there, do stuff that you have fun with, enjoy it, jam with other people, jam by yourself, but at least get playing, get inspired, have some fun. All right, cool. All right, the other cool pedal we have today is the Duality DX. Uh, it's a dual gain stage pedal where you have a modern, a kind of fusion, and then a classic gain stage. Uh, it's brand new to me. I just did a quick little Google, read the little thing on their website of what it is and explains it. Um, it's definitely more used, I guess, for high gain applications. So yeah, um, borrowed my buddy's hands again. You'll hear him play that pedal. I'm going to focus on the Fig Fun, but we'll give you a taste of both. So, a pedal that I showed up to the studio today and made him inspired. Um, and then I brought my own pedal uh, that I was hoping to get inspired with today. First time I played it, other than a couple chords at work, make sure it works. That was it, just to make sure it's like, oh yeah, I like this. I instantly, I bumped the, the frequency knob a little bit more to the mid side. First time I strum chords, it was freaking love at first ring, dude. It was awesome. I'm all about the fuzzes. I do a lot of more single note stuff, a little bit more melody. Um, I get as far as what I think of this tone. So we'll see how it uh, stacks up um, with uh, both of us playing it. And we'll, uh, we'll go from there. And then I'll check out the DAE because I haven't had a chance to even plug that in and dial it for me yet. So let's see if it inspires me to play something different. Might kick on some delays, kind of some contrasts. You know, fun contrasts. It's fun to switch it up in life. You know, don't always have to do the same thing every day, day in, day out, unless you love it. And then, it's like I do, I freaking love what I do. So this is great. All right. Thanks for coming along for the journey. All right, let's get after it.
you to pick. transition. Let's see what I can do. Okay, it's all about being inspired. A little bit over a weird long form video, but this is my process. Like, this is how I jam out and have fun. So I figured I'd bring you guys along with me. Like, why not? Sounds cool. At least you'll understand the tones. Like, hopefully that'll come across good. But let's get after it. So now it's... on the duality DAE. I'm sure we'll do an in-depth video on this. Apparently this is a super popular like unobtainium pedal. I had no idea. I show up to the studio today and it's not new guitar day but it's new pedal day for my buddy that I run this with and the hands I borrow, that guy, and uh, and this. So yeah, freaking sweet. So you'll see him uh, playing a little bit on this on the duality and the fig thumb. Uh, he's not much of a fuzz dude but I'm slowly bringing him over with my kind of style of play. So, uh, yeah, he's bringing me more to the darker, heavier side, and I'm bringing him more to, like, kind of the, the groovier, more melodic side, I guess. So, yeah, it's been a, it's been a fun journey. So let's, uh, let's keep creating together, and uh, thanks for stopping by. Give the beloved. We out!